Ever since I was a kid, it was my dream to be invited to VidCon, but I was irrelevant. VidCon is the biggest event of the year for any creator. It's like being a filmmaker and being invited to the Grammys or being a designer and being invited to the Met Gala. I remember in 2018, I went to VidCon and hosted meetups in the parking lot, knowing I was not famous enough to actually be invited indoors. I seriously can't believe this year I got invited to speak at VidCon. I reached out to the CEO of VidCon around eight months ago during the pandemic to showcase my new NFT project. Their team really liked what I was doing and invited me to be a speaker shortly. Now I'm speaking on two sessions about crypto and NFTs for VidCon Abu Dhabi. Hey yo, welcome to my vlog. I'm about to go to VidCon. I'm bringing this luggage and then I'm bringing my bone backpack and I'm I'm just so happy I didn't overpack. We're about to head out. I fly out at 6.25 p.m. It's currently 3 p.m. So we're right on track. If you guys don't know, this is like my new bad obsession, which is upgrading and getting like the last minute discounts on like economy flights into business. And it's just such a satisfying feeling not to pay full price, but feel like a million bucks. Oh, it's a 15 minute drive to LAX. Let's go. Okay, so I just got to the LAX airport. I got their security and I really do hate myself for saying this, but I did get that this is upgrade. And <laughs> I know how ridiculously unnecessary this is. I, I know, but this is like, I never buy any nice things for myself. I don't go to like designer stores. This is the only thing I cherish in life, okay? The cool thing about getting a business class ticket is you also get access to the lounge where you get more food. So we're gonna go do that first. I have a chicken dish with rice with some vegetables and a salad. I have some sparkling water and we're on the sixth floor. As you guys know, if you've been watching my channel, I literally started from like nothing. You know, I didn't have money. I literally stole my school's camera so I could film videos and it's crazy to like have your guys' support. I would 100% take you guys on business class any day. I'm in the bathroom because I'm too embarrassed to like film actually outside. They handed me this really nice bag that looks like- Oh my god, it's Versace. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, this is dope. It has toothbrushes and like lotion and lip balms. The bag is so cute. I'm impressed. Okay, um, I'm a mess. I just arrived to Turkey for my layover and I literally bored in 10 minutes. I'm gonna miss my flight to Abu Dhabi. <laughs> I fucking made it. I'm in line to go down. Okay, so it's like 5 a.m. I got back to my hotel at 4 a.m. because my luggage got lost. When I landed in Abu Dhabi, it was like 2 a.m. and I noticed something was wrong. My luggage was missing. I couldn't find it at all at baggage claim. Uh, and then I went to the front desk and they basically were like, yeah. It's not here. Your baggage is stuck in Istanbul during that layover. Great. <laughs> I have no clothes. It's time to go shopping. Y'all, update. I'm at Forever 21. I'm trying to fucking put together an outfit, but this is the shit I'm running into. Be greater. That looks like 2013. What the fuck is that? Free spirit. How do I put together an outfit for VidCon with this? All right, guys. So I'm back in my hotel. I got a bunch of stuff from the store. Tomorrow is the big day, and hopefully I don't cry on stage. <laughs> Morning, everybody. <laughs> Today's the day where I speak at VidCon, and honestly, I did not sleep at all last night. I'm just trying my best to make it through today, and I haven't been really eating, and you know, I still don't have my luggage, but it's okay. I'm so thankful. We're gonna have a great day and get ready together. Woo! Okay, let's remove the mask. Whew. Time burns. That's not good. I practiced my presentation all night last night. I was literally going back and forth from watching the Nick Jonas concert to practicing my presentation at my hotel, to going back to the concert. Whenever I'm stressed, my eczema gets really bad. It's not bad right now because in Abu Dhabi, the humidity really helps. Usually, like, I will have cracks, so you can kind of see it on my skin, and if I don't take care of myself, it physically will affect me. Overall, my session at VidCon was 
great. I met so many creators who love my NFT project, learned about NFTs. I had venture funds reach out about investing into my project, which is great because we are raising $400,000. A bunch of agencies from the UAE want the NFT project to go to the Middle East. So overall, it was really great. And although it didn't go exactly my way, I feel like I did my best and I feel like I showed up with confidence on stage. The last day after I spoke, I visited the Grand Mosque. It was so nice to finally have a break. I was so stressed during the week and I finally could look back and see the beauty of Abu Dhabi. We just finished the day. We're going to Ferrari World. <laughs> Ferrari World apparently invited the whole VidCon creators and speakers. So we had the whole amusement park to ourselves. If you guys don't know, Ferrari World has the fastest roller coaster in the world. If you Google it, it is like uh, 240 kilometers per hour. Like it is so fast. I'm really nervous to go on a roller coaster, but Ben, are you gonna go on all of them? Uh, every single one of them. Yeah, go on all of them? I'm he wants to go on the them. fastest one, the first one. He no, wants to go. No, no, I am not doing that. I'm just so excited. Okay, let's do the kids one. Yeah, I'll do the kids one too. I'm with you on that. We just finished the fastest roller coaster yeah, in the world. She's nauseous. I was actually really fun. I just didn't like the first like 15 seconds. I'm shaking. There's literally a sign here that says, do not ride this ride in 15 minutes. How was it? It was so good. Good God! Good God! All right, guys. So I am done with VidCon and this weekend has honestly been crazy. Although it didn't go exactly as planned, I was just so happy that I persevered because it was so worth it. Like I met so many people, so many companies who are interested in working with NFTree. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys so much. Seriously, a lot of you guys have been watching me since I dropped out of high school. <laughs> so who do you would be in fucking Dubai when I'm 20 years old speaking of VidCon? Thank you guys. I love you.